My father was a good man. He loved his family through thick and thin, and always stayed true. He taught me all I know, how to hunt, how to trap, how to be a man. My father also passed a very special gift, a gift only our bloodline holds. It intensifies my predator instincts. It's like I can smell their scent radiating from their tracks. When I take aim, I swear I can see their heart in their chest. I am thankful my father gave me this gift so I can use it to make my living long after he's gone. One thing he loved to say is, John, once you take that shot, you forget everything in the world except you and the animal. It doesn't matter what happened up to that moment or what's going to happen after. It's just you and them. Ah, ah, fuck. You fucking thing. Where are you? There you are. Ah. Never mention that the feeling left you by the time the kill is on your horse. No one knows what it's like to be the bad man, to be the sad man. Behind blue eyes No one knows what it's like To be hated To be faded To telling only lies But my dreams They aren't as empty As my conscience seems Steve. Hey, Steve. Where you at, man? I got that cougar for you that was coming at night. Steve? Huh. Guess he's not here. I'll just leave this for him. I'll come back tomorrow. Tumbleweed, about as good as the cat I just left. This is a good reason I don't do jobs for friends. Let's see if this shithole still got that stuff from Gorma, shall we? Hey, Steve! Oh, hey, John. I see you found that gift I left you last night. Yes, thank you. I was just giving it to the butcher because I'm too busy to clean it right now. No problem. 
You helped me out a while back, so I owed you one. So anyways, where were you last night? I was expecting you to just be finishing up work and have a nice pot of stew on the fire. Oh, uh, some friends came into town last night and left this morning. I was just over at their camp for a few drinks and passed out there. Heh, <laughs> don't go getting in trouble now. We live too far apart for you to come running to me. <laughs> uh, but seriously, you need help? You can always come home. You know that. Right, brother? Yeah, I know. But do you remember what I told Dad? I want us to have a future. A real future. And I feel the oil in the ground here, so I will stay. Okay, but you know where I am. See you in a bit, alright? I'm taking a break before grizzly mating season. Need to gear up. I feel like it's going to be a long one. Okay, sounds good. See you in a while. Steve has a lot of qualities of our father. Ruthlessness was never one. He truly loves working hard to give those around him a better chance at life. A better future. So that he does, trying to be an oil man. Where there are no oil men. He says he feels it under his feet. I hope he doesn't spiral chasing this feeling of oil. Yet here I am, chasing another feeling my father once knew. I know my father used hunting as an escape after my mother died. He taught me everything I know about hunting, and I thank him dearly. After his passing, he left me the farm and hope. Just like him, Steve and I will likely forever chase that feeling. Because who doesn't need to forget the past? No one knows what it's like to be the bad man. To be the sad man. Behind blue eyes. No one knows what it's like to be hated, to be faded, to telling only lies.